I'm Roger Dixon. I've worked at Fermi Lab since 1977, and my early years here were particularly interesting. I uh, had a young technician or summer student working with me once. His name was Chris Winter. He had been a physics major at Northwestern, and he came to work for the summer, but he wanted to work a while longer before he went to graduate school or decided what to do with his life next. He had played basketball at Northwestern. Chris was a, a great young man to work with. And one night I had him working some overtime down in one of the shops in the basement. And he was alone and he didn't like to be alone because he was so social, but he saw a guy across the way grinding and welding and grinding and welding. And he timed his move. So he waited until the guy tipped back his helmet and was taking a break. And Chris walked over to him and said, what have they got you doing in here tonight? He didn't have any idea who Bob Wilson was, but the man was Bob Wilson. And Bob told him, I'm working on a sculpture that's gonna go out in front of the high rise and it's going to go in the reflecting pond. And Chris said, boy, they can think of more ways for you to waste your time around here, can't they? And Wilson gave him a lecture on aesthetics, and he knew who Bob Wilson was after that.